worse and worse in the next couple of days here. It's bad already, but uh, we've got continuation of water draining out of the smaller creeks and streams into the bigger rivers. And that means the delayed onset of the highest river levels still till Friday or Saturday. Randy Factor gets a four for Friday. It's going to be unpleasant for being working outside. A couple of showers, some snow showers and very strong winds. 60 and 39 today. Last time we were 60, November 1st. Yeah, it's been a while. 83 hundredths of an inch of rain today, nearly two, two inches for the month and five inches of precipitation for the year. It's all pretty quiet downtown, a few sprinkles. Current temperature 53 southeast breeze still blowing, but it will be much harder tomorrow from the northwest. Flood warnings in the bright green for rivers. Flash flood warning for the area out here in central Nebraska, west of York and Columbus, goes until 1145. Water out of the Platte River, out of the Loop River. Flood watch in the dark green. And again, the bright green are all the area rivers and streams that have flood warnings on them. Some of those go through the weekend as the Missouri River will be highest especially down here in southeast Nebraska toward northwest Missouri by Saturday and Sunday. Temperatures in the 50s, that continues melting the snowpack that's out there. Light rain spread out from York and Columbus to Norfolk, West Point and Fremont, lifting northeastward, just sprinkles and light showers in the Omaha metro here. Not a lot of rain with this. Maybe a couple tenths of an inch of rain overnight tonight and into tomorrow for the Omaha metro. Here's the storm. Wow, intense area of low pressure, blizzard conditions, high winds on the backside, but it's starting to move now and lose some of its moisture. And our computer model suggests just sprinkles here overnight. Southeast winds persist and much of the night will be dry in the Omaha area. But by morning, the center of this low will start to move up into the uh, Omaha metro region. There's 5 a.m. There's 7 a.m. right on top of us here. Very deep area of low pressure, sprinkles and showers for the morning drive. And as the low moves east of us, we pick up strong northwest winds on the backside, but see the snow is kind of broken up here. So just spotty snow showers, but still extremely windy and much colder by later in the day. Temperatures falling. We'll call it impact weather from mid morning onward with the strong northwest winds that could gust over 50 miles per hour. But again, the amount of rain going forward pretty light here, just uh, maybe a couple tenths of an inch in the Omaha Metro. Heavier snow tomorrow morning in northern Nebraska, parts of South Dakota, stays north of the Omaha area. Low pressure moves away. The strong northwest winds blow in Friday. Still kind of breezy and chilly, but importantly, dry weather at least. Tonight, the low temperature, 43. Uh, we have seen a couple of showers and thunderstorms go by to the west of us, just more like a few showers in the Omaha metro. Still some showers at 8 a.m., 40 degrees. Very strong northwest winds, 25, 40, gusting 50 and maybe gusting as high as 55 miles an hour for a time in the afternoon. You see the temperatures falling during the day. We've got that 41 degree high temperature for tomorrow, 40 on Friday, 48 on Saturday and 49 on Sunday. So a little more tolerable weather for the weekend. But even this weekend with the sunshine, the water will still be rising on the Missouri River all the way through Saturday into Sunday. Oh,